what up guys in this video i want to show you how to buy a hero from the meta hero project step by step now to buy a hero you can buy it either from a centralized exchange or a decentralized exchange but there are advantages from buying from a decentralized exchange and one is that there are over 70 million dollars worth of hero bnb lock on pancake swap permanently and when you buy from a dex you have you are in control of your hero all the time so let's all start with how to buy from a decentralized exchange now to do that you need bnb which is a binance coin you also need a private wallet and a dex now for to buy bnb you can buy bnb from binance crypto.com kucoin and gates.io there are others but the one you choose depends on which of these exchanges supports your country and is the payment uh, method available to you so once you've bought hero then you will need um, a private wallet where you will send it to so you need either a trust wallet or metamax there are also others but trust wallet and metamax are more like the most popular they need a decentralized exchange in this case pancake swap so we're going to do this we're going to buy um, bnb from crypto.com then send it to trust wallet then from trust wallet swap it on pancake swap to hero and have it back on trust wallet so we'll start by i'll start by showing you how to configure your trust wallet so let, let's get to my phone so guys let's go to setting up the trust wallet to do that we'll click on play store then type trust wallet then we have to install this so we have to create um, a new wallet agree continue now so this is a recovery phrase you have to keep this phrase like safe because anyone that has access to this recovery phrase have access to your wallet and in case you lose your device you will need this phrase to to gain access or gain access to your wallet now you can't see this because it's meant to be private so you go ahead and copy it down and re-enter it to continue So yes, my trust wallet is set up. Now you can see at the bottom menu, you see wallets, dApps, DEX, and settings. If you look at the iPhone or the iOS, the thing is iOS does not allow you to set up dApps on trust wallet. What you have to do is we'll go to Safari browser and enter pancakeswap.finance. Now, when we get there, then we'll click on connect wallet then wallet connect then we select trust wallet so this i use dApps on trust wallets when you're using the ios so anytime you want to go to dApps you just go to your safari browser and perform the function from there you see that your wallet is already connected now let me go back to my android and continue so now that we've set up the trust wallets the next thing is to purchase bnb and send it to the trust wallet so we'll be doing this using crypto.com now if you're using any other exchange like binance or get.io you can just send bnb to the smart chain this is a smart chain right you can send it straight to the smart chain but for crypto.com um you can't send that number what we'll do is to send bnb to this bnb so to this bnb so there are two types of bnb here you have this bnb on the binance um chain and this is on the binance smart chain now what we need is bnb on the binance smart chain but for crypto.com we'll send bnb to um the normal smart to the normal chain then swap it for the binance smart chain so let's go to crypto.com and do that first we'll copy the wallet address here from the bnb wallet so i will click on receive then copy and head over to crypto.com so crypto.com allows you to buy bnb directly with your credit card or debit card or you can buy with all the crypto now i already have some coins here on the app what i'll do is to just buy bnb with another coin to do that i'll click on trade then buy 
then enter the coin I want to buy. In this case, BNB, Binance coin. Then I can buy with my card. You can see it's already here. Or I will choose to buy with another crypto. So I will tap on crypto wallet. Select CRO. Now what I want to buy is 0 0.5 BNB. This is about $200. Then buy. Confirm. So I purchased 0 0.5 so now that I've purchased BNB, the next thing is to transfer it to another wallet. So what I will do is tap BNB here, that is Binance Coin here. Then I'll click on Transfer. Then I have to withdraw this by clicking on Withdraw. External Wallet, and I have to add the wallet address. I can add it by clicking this plus sign here, or just clicking Add Wallet Address. So I'll go ahead and do that. So what I will do is add BNB on the Binance chain. I've already copied the address. I just paste it and we don't need memo here. I can enter the wallet name. The wallet name, let me call it Trust Wallet. Trust Wallet BNB. And click on continue. And enter my 2FA. So I've added this. The next thing is to click on withdraw and enter 0 0.5 BNB and click on withdraw. So this has been submitted. I will just wait for it to arrive my trust wallet. So guys, this is how you buy Hero on PancakeSwap. I hope that was pretty easy. Like I said, you just, you have uh, an exchange where you buy BNB, you take it to Trust Wallet and you swap it for Hero, then have it back on Trust Wallet. Really, really simple. Now, if you wanna buy Hero directly without going through all this, you can do that on a centralized exchange. And currently, you can buy Hero on BitMart and um, gates.io, you can buy it directly on this exchange. I'll be leaving the link in the description. And also, finally, Hero will also be listed on Kanga Exchange. This means that you can buy Hero directly with your fiat money, especially if you're living in Poland and Ukraine. And this brings us to the end of this video. I hope you enjoyed it, and I hope you learned a number of things from it. So let me know in the comment section, um, have you bought Hero? What other videos, explainer videos, or how-to videos do you want me to make? I'll be waiting for your comments in the comment section. That said, I hope you liked this video. If you did, please um, give us a like and um, also smash that bell icon to get notified when my next video comes out. And subscribe if you have not and show us love by sharing this video. I'm waiting for your comments in the comment section. Tell me what other video do you think I should do? What other explainer video? do you think I should do? That said, I will see you in the next one. Bye.